Hi everybody and welcome to this lesson on looking at the Amazon Aurora database. Now in the previous lesson we looked at all of the database instances which Amazon Relational Database Service offers, which of which Amazon Aurora was one, but I wanted to take a closer look at Amazon Aurora to demonstrate some of the benefits it has because the cloud practitioner exam does focus a little bit more on the Amazon Aurora since it is a proprietary database which is offered by AWS. So essentially Aurora is a MySQL and PostgreSQL compatible relational database built for the cloud that combines the performance and availability of traditional enterprise databases with the simplicity and cost effectiveness of open source databases. It's up to five times faster than standard MySQL databases and three times faster than the standard PostgreSQL database. It provides the security, availability, and reliability of commercial databases at literally one-tenth of the cost. It's, a f it's fully managed by the relational database service, which we looked at in the previous lesson, which automates time-consuming admin tasks like hardware provisioning, database setup, patching, and backups. Aurora features a distributed fault-tolerant self-healing storage system that auto-scales up to 64 terabytes per database instance. It delivers high performance and availability with up to 15 low latency read replicas, point in time recovery, continuous backup to the Amazon S3, and replication across three different availability zones. Additionally, MySQL and PostgreSQL compatibility make Aurora a compelling target for database migrations to the cloud. So if your organization is migrating from MySQL or PostgreSQL, Amazon does offer support for them to move into Aurora. Since they are pushing organizations to start using Aurora, they have made it a lot easier for companies to migrate their existing MySQL or PostgreSQL databases into Aurora. And for most organizations, it would definitely make sense because First of all, the cost is extremely low, and secondly, the performance is extremely high. So it is a great option if an organization is moving to AWS, they might as well also think about and look at migrating the databases into Aurora as well. Another benefit of the Amazon Aurora uh, Amazon Aurora is that it gives you custom endpoints which allow you to distribute and load balance workloads across different sets of database instances. So for example, you may provision a set of Aurora replicas to use an instance type with higher memory capacity in order to run an analytics workload. A custom endpoint can then help you route the, analy the analytics workload to these appropriately configured instances while keeping other instances isolated from this workload. Now there are a host of other benefits that come with Aurora which get a little bit in-depth and are out of the scope of this course. Those in-depth information are more geared towards the Solutions Architect Associate and Solutions Architect Professional Examinations. So we're not going to get into those but just keep these main benefits in mind for the Cloud Practitioner's Exam. So let's go ahead and log into our Management Console and see all the different options that we are able to configure for Amazon Aurora.